All right, guys, good morning. Last day of pre-fish on Darbo, which basically means we're just gonna go out there and fish and have a great time and try to solidify the areas that we, uh, we're fishing. My partner, Mike, is getting ready. We actually are staying in an Airbnb that has its own boat ramp, which is super nice. Uh, only way I would do it. So, especially when you're on Darbo and there's a lot of houses that do have their own boat ramp and uh, that makes it super convenient. But Mike's jumping on right now, there he goes. And all we're doing today is checking out our spots before the tournament tomorrow. So, here we go. Find out. Yeah, that's a good fish. 160. Mm. Good fish to start the episode off, guys. Solid slab right there. Bam. All right, guys, we're going to show you the, uh, the infamous loop knot right here. Turtled around, push that right back through, and there you go. This is the jig I'm having the most success with, I feel, black and chartreuse. So there's your loop knot right there, guys, hanging vertical. We're trying a different uh, weight setup during this trail. There it is, tungsten. Um, with the bobber stoppers uh, so far I don't really care for it but and the reason why is the weight of this will get tangled up into those split uh, those bobber stoppers that drives me nuts so always open for suggestions let me know we'll find out gosh white crappie are so easy they suck us. I hate to say it. All day long to set the hook. Holy moly. Boom. Right, guys just an eater fish here on Darbone but still a solid fish you'd love to get these fish anywhere in the country so you know that's basically about 12 and a half inch fish but here not much of a tournament fish for sure but let me run you through the uh, the equipment we've got the Savage 13 which is been really really exciting to use we're using it as a 15 footer so just to kind of give you guys a reminder the Savage can be transformed into a 15 or a 16 footer by adding midsections that comes with it so check that out sniping braid using the optimized my go-to when i come to these big body of water sometimes i'll use the 12 pound meteor as well as, as my partner mike does um, trying a different uh, setup with the weight um, i don't know it's nice i guess i don't have to worry about piercing the line uh, but it does seem to get tangled up a little bit more than typical the reel it's a 200 series 300 three pound fishing reel all these items 
every single thing you've seen right here can get purchased on the website 3poundfishing.com so check that out including the hair jigs hair jigs have, have been working great um, definitely going to be our go-to for the tournament but it's windy Ooh, good fish oh tank guys tank. oh my gosh oh man that's beautiful there you go guys Darbone special right there beautiful thanks for watching we're gonna let this guy go hopefully save him for tournament day um thanks for watching i appreciate it please subscribe and all that good stuff we're gonna take you to championship saturday whether it's good or bad right now we're uh we're just we're just fishing so we're gonna see how it turns out and i think we're doing about as good as anybody else i guess and we just have to hope that everything aligns on tournament day but anyway appreciate you check out darbone the airbnbs that they have on this lake are fantastic take advantage of that as you saw what we're what we have right now look for one with a boat ramp if possible and uh, all of these products that we're talking about and we're using are available on the website and check out mike's slab jacker over there at brush pile jigs take it easy guys have a great one